29.1, Components of the Plant Body. Now plants typically are made of two systems. We have the shoot system, which is basically above ground, consisting of the stem and leaves and flowers. And then we have the root system, which consists of the primary roots and lateral roots. Now shoots and roots. Shoots uh, produce food by photosynthesis and they also carry out the reproductive fun functions. So the leaves and the green stem are where photosynthesis occurs in the mesophyll tissue and the reproductive structures would be the flowers. Now the roots, the root system is going to anchor the plant, penetrate the soil and absorb water and dissolve minerals and also store food depending on the root system. So the the root system consists of a primary root and then also lateral roots that come off the sides of the primary root. Now the shoot system uh, consists of an apical or terminal bud which is located at the tip of the plant, the very top. Um, this is where primary growth occurs, where the plant is going to increase in height. Uh, we also have a stem, which is this region here. We have a petiole. A petiole is where the leaf branches off of the stem. Now the area where a petiole is connected to a stem is called a node. So right here, this is the node. Located in the node, there is an axillary bud or a lateral bud. You can see that here. These are in black. This is where secondary growth would occur in the plant. So the lateral bud is where new branches or leaves will start to grow. Now normally in a plant's life cycle, um, the growth is primarily located at the terminal bud or apical bud because uh, a plant is going to want to increase in size to compete for resources such as sunlight. Um, however, if the terminal bud or is removed, let's say it's eaten by a predator, or it's blocked, maybe it's in shade, then the plant will concentrate its resources and increase in size by the lateral buds. Um, we also have leaves, which will be discussed in a later chapter. And then the angle of the petiole to the stem is called an axle. Now, a plant will increase in its primary growth uh, which means it'll grow taller if it's a shoot system or the roots will extend more into the soil if it is um, the shoot system. Now a meristem is a, a uh, location on the plant where there's embryonic cells that are undifferentiated, meaning they can become uh, any of the three types of plant tissues. That is where growth is going to occur. That's where the most mitosis is occurring. Um, this is found at the apical um, meristem, which is at the tip of the shoot or the tip of the root. Those are both called uh, apical meristems, and most of the primary growth will occur there.